both the British and the Jews did not um, give enough attention to the fact that there was an existing population in Palestine that did not welcome the creation of a Jewish national home in Palestine. The Arabs believed that, first of all, they were entitled to independence in Palestine, so they opposed the whole concept of a mandate. Now, it seems absurd today. How could you ignore such an obvious issue? You must understand that uh, in the uh, ethos of the time, where it was believed that the introduction of European settlements into underdeveloped areas would only increase the, um, would benefit the existing native populations, that everyone would do well out of it. This was a expression of liberal colonialism that in retrospect looks incredibly naive, but at the time they were firmly committed to it.